My name is Alan Crooks, I'm the manager for the Northern Ireland Power Chair team. Um, we actually started a power chair programme in 2010 and the kids were just in their day chairs and we put like milk crates in the front and to think, you know, 13 years later we're going to a World Cup in Australia, I mean, it's unbelievable the progression that's been. Yeah, well, in 2019 we played in our first international tournament which was the European Championships in Finland and we just went um, with no expectation whatsoever. Um, and to, to actually finish in fifth place and qualify for the World Cup, everyone was just looking at each other in disbelief. It was unbelievable. Since 2019, the coach Michael Hill has been absolutely amazing. I mean, I couldn't speak highly enough of him. He's, uh, the work rate he's put into to the group as a whole has been unbelievable. They're training every other week uh, for three and a half hours and the progression's been unbelievable. The whole style of play has changed, the attitude's changed throughout the squad in a real positive way. As a group, working with them for the last four years, uh, from 2019, it's been fantastic. On a personal level, my, my, my uh, youngest son uh, plays for the team. Um, seen him personally growing, developing, um, structurally uh, developing as a person um, and as a player over the last number of years. We have a good group of players, we have a good group coming through, there's younger players coming in who are pushing the senior players uh, for places now, which has been great um, from a competition level. I'll go, you stick. One, press deal. <laughs> The aim would be to have the, the squad prepared to the best of our ability and the players perform to the best of their ability but also too if opportunities come we have to be, to be, able, to be able to position ourselves to score goals out there. So those would be the aims to defend but also to try and attack when opportunities come. Yeah well listen it's all positive I mean if you knew the, ch the children involved um, and the backgrounds they've had and the progression they've made they just love power chair football and it's great to see um, and now they're getting good at it and really competitive and it's, it's just brilliant. Football is football, it doesn't matter if you have a disability or you don't have a disability. You know, I'm sure their parents are very proud of them the way myself and Michael are. I mean disability football is on the rise, um, the IFA is really behind it. Um, we are a leading sport in terms of providing opportunities for people with disabilities and to have one of our squads competing on a world stage in Australia in a World Cup and the, you know the promotion that that will give. Uh, to disability football in Northern Ireland is really positive, so hopefully we'll go and make the country proud.